congratulations, you just won Best Festival. How does it feel? It's good, especially for France, you know, because France don't really have the reputation to be a great country for metal and rock music. But now with the LFS, you know, when Ben decided to do this 15 years ago, he had a vision. And now uh, this vision became the third biggest music event in France and the first in have a budget. So I can tell you it's, it's, it's really, really important for France. It's good. I haven't been lucky enough to attend the festival, but I've looked at visuals from the festival. It looks like a film set. It looks like some sort of futuristic dystopia in metal world. It looks incredible. How much effort goes into just the aesthetic and the look of the festival? It's all coming from Ben, you know, the, the, the programmer, the director, the manager of the festival. He, as I said, he had a vision and he works with many, many uh, uh, designer companies who built like the Lemmy, Lemmy statue, you know, like we, 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 we did a few years ago. He stayed there for the year. The whole field is there for the year. So when you go to Clisson now, you can be on the field of the Elfest and you see some family with the kids and you, so, you can see some chips, you know, and then you can go to, you can go to see the Eye to Lemmy. So, so uh, the festival is there all the, the whole year in Clisson. Really shaken hold of that area. Definitely. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> yeah, I know. Now the lineup this year was absolutely incredible. How do you aim to top it? I know you've got Slayer already on the bill for next year. <laughs> for next year, we already announced this year. You know, last year the festival was sold out in October mm. for for June without announcing any band. So this year we decided to do a special gift to the fans mm. because they always like buy the tickets blindfold. So this year we we announced five bands already. So we had the Carcass. Massistaria, which, in one, which is uh, one of the, the top French band, uh, Slayer, Grokic Murphys, and Man of War. What a mixture there. Yes, but we have all the, this is, I think it reflects what Elfes is. What you do best. Yes, yeah. you, you have heavy metal with Man of War, you have a punk with, with, uh, with uh, Grokic Murphys, uh, death metal with uh, Carcass, Trash metal with Slayer, so uh, so no, no that's that's uh, you know when you go to a fest you have six stages and each stage reflects it's it's like little festivals inside the festivals. Mm. Yeah. So what to you makes a good festival? Like what is on your tick list? Like it needs to have that. It needs to have that. It has to be a place where you want to come back with your friends. This is so when you go to a fest you go for the for the some people go only for the headliners on the main stages. And uh, some people come only for the small stage because they can find something that they will see in the small club in Paris in front of 200 people. And then they saw the band playing in front of 10,000, you know. But also the decoration, uh, what's happening beside the festival, you know, at the camping, uh, we call it the metal corner, you know, we have stage after. When the festival is done, then the night starts, you know. And, and you can see the design, you have, we have the LCT Square, which is like a village, you know. And, uh, you know, when you are at Elfest, when you are on stage, you don't see any advertisement. When you are on stage, you see the decoration, you know. At night, it goes, it goes on fire. You never see, that, oh, buy a burger or a pizza. No, you just see decoration for metal. It's just an interactive experience exactly. for everyone. Exactly. Now, what is your all-time favorite Hellfest memory? Just to close this interview, pick out you know a moment. Me, as a PR, as a PR, yeah. I barely don't see any band. Only in the evening, you know. So unfair, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, this is. A, but so, so of course, you know. Uh, you know, when I was a kid, I was traveling to Castle Donington, you know, to Vacan, to to uh, to uh, uh, Dynamo Open Air. Uh, but I must say that last year, when uh, Prophet of Rage came, the show was amazing. Yeah. That kind of stuff, you know. This is what I like, you know. So yeah. Next year, even better, perhaps. Oh, definitely. So watch the space. Yeah, and I know some things you don't know yet. Oh, <laughs> give me an exclusive. Come on, Dan. <laughs> I tried. Lovely to meet you, and congratulations, okay. a worthy you. winner. Thank you. Thank you.